Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. It's me again, Aisha, and today we are going to do a strawberry inspired nail art. Let's start with our color primer. Normally, I would use a white nail polish, but since our main color is sheer pink, I decided to use a darker tone instead. I'm just applying two coats of reset from Bobbi. Now I'm putting on Heartstone, also from Bobbi. It's really sheer, so even when you apply two coats of it, our first color would slightly be visible and that's how exactly we want it. Onto the thumb design, I'm using Big Apple Red from OPI to create a half a slanted heart shape for our strawberries. Before it dries, get a toothpick and just cut it in the middle, then apply a darker tone of red to emphasize the division, followed by a coat of your strawberries color. For the leaves, I am using Central Park by Basic and just applying it with a flat angled brush. Dip the pointed end of a toothpick on a yellow polish. I am using Champagne Bubbles from China Glaze to create those little dots of seeds outside of the strawberries. The index finger is supposed to have one big strawberry in it. Now apply your red polish in a dome shape. With the same brush and nail polish I used earlier, you may now start creating your leaves. And finally, dot the seeds. For the ring finger, we are going to make several small strawberries by dotting the round end of a toothpick, creating small triangles. The angle of your strawberries depend on where you position your leaves, and it's much better if it's not pointing on the same direction. On to the last variation of our design, we are just going to do a really thick French tip on our middle finger as well as our baby finger. With a striper brush, create a thin line between the pink and the red polish as a breaker. Add dots on your French tip to get the same texture as our strawberries. Finally, place two green tear-shaped gems along the green line as if it were its leaves. And we're done! For more updates, don't forget to subscribe on our channel. Thank you for watching!